Now, of course, to every criticism, the Leave campaign will cry project fear. This actually is a term invented in Scotland. I know that. I make no apology for asking tough questions and examining their case, because this momentous decision, if we decide to leave, is irreversible. And I've been here before, and nobody is going to stop me asking hard questions when the future of our country is at stake. Every time we hear this cry, we should ask why, because it's their own fear of the spotlight of legitimate security. In Scotland, where the nationalists claimed in 2014 that oil prices would stay uh, above $100 a barrel, experts called this into question and pointed out the volatility of oil prices. The nationalists said this was project fear. It was scaremongering. Today, unfortunately, the oil price is a fraction of what it was back then. If Scotland had left the UK and followed the nationalist plan that relied very heavily on oil revenues, it would have blown a massive hole in Scotland's finances. Indeed, Scotland would have faced cuts today that make look, would make austerity look like a Sunday afternoon picnic, and the victims would have been Scottish families and businesses. So it's not project fear. In truth, it's a reality check, the kind anyone would rightly take before making an enormous decision uh, affecting their lives.